Vanessa Casbaum became seriously ill shortly after she gave birth to her son in 2010. At a time when she really needed support, the government denied her sick benefit claim. Some women who were unjustly denied benefits by this government have since received payments, but more than 3,000 of them have been forced to go to court to try to get justice for the unfairness perpetrated by this government. Why are the Conservatives refusing to give women like Carissa Casbaum the benefits they paid for, the benefits they need to support their families? The Honourable Minister of Employment. Mr. Speaker, our hearts go out to any family in these difficult circumstances. That's why in 2013, our government brought forward the Helping Families in Need Act to ensure that parents who fall ill during their parental claim can receive their sickness benefits. As the uh, matter in question is, is before the courts, it would be inappropriate to comment. We have delivered results for all future cases by passing the Fairness for Family, Helping Families in Need Act. Thank you. And the Honourable Member for London Fanshawe. Mr. Speaker, what about the 3,000? They always have money for their wealthy friends, but nothing for Canadians in need. The Conservatives just don't seem to be able to grasp that the money in the EI account doesn't belong to them. Exactly. It belongs to Canadians. Fewer than four in ten unemployed Canadians get EI benefits. Yet instead of improving access, the Conservatives are raiding the account to pay for tax cuts for the wealthy. Why are the Conservatives giving the rich the benefits they don't need and leaving unemployed Canadians to fend for themselves? Three thousand of them. The Honourable Minister of Speaker, our hearts uh, go out to anybody who finds themselves in these difficult circumstances. That's why back in 2013, we introduced the Helping Families in Need Act. This act will ensure that people who fall ill while they are collecting parental leave can also get sickness benefits. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Monsieur le Président, 20 000 travailleurs ont perdu leur emploi en avril pendant que 1,3 million de Québécois et de Canadiens étaient déjà au chômage. Chaque paie, ils avaient cotisé à la Caisse d'assurance-emploi, mais moins de 4 chômeurs sur 10 recevront les prestations au moment où ils en ont besoin. Pourquoi? Bien parce que les conservateurs, comme les libéraux avant eux, pillent la Caisse d'assurance-emploi pour offrir des cadeaux à leurs amis au lieu d'offrir aux travailleurs l'assurance qu'ils se sont Payé. Monsieur le Président, quand les conservateurs cesseront-ils de détourner les cotisations des chômeurs pour faire des chèques aux plus nantis? Monsieur le Président, l'honorable député a tort. Ces faits sont les mauvais. La réalité, c'est que le, le, le compte d'assurance emploi s'équilibre au moyen terme. Pendant la récession, il y a eu un déficit dans le camp. Maintenant, le camp rembourse ce déficit. Mais, Monsieur le Président, nous, euh, nous allons réduire des cotisations en 2017 pour, euh, euh, pour euh, réduire les coûts aux entreprises et aux travailleurs. Ça va créer des emplois. Les néo-démocrates veulent augmenter des, des cotisations, ce qui va tuer des emplois. Allez, on 